Tasneem has just turned 20. She was born in Melbourne. On the weekends, yeah, it was always the beach during the summer. After her parents split, Tasneem was sent from her Meadow Heights home in Melbourne to Lebanon, a remote village near Tripoli, where she was told she would visit her grandparents for a month. Instead, she was married to a 24-year-old man with a violent criminal history. I was 14. All I was thinking of was the beautiful white dress and that amazing wedding I'm going to get. What, what did you find out about your husband? Rape. Um, stealing. Rape. Yeah, stealing. Also a drug addict, he quickly became abusive. You know, I only hurt you because I love you and I want the best for you. That, that line is every violent man's line. That's when I started packing my bag and I'm like, that's it, I'm leaving. I heard this woman laughing. She was our other neighbour. She's like, to me, love, there's no way out of here. They either kill you or break you. I would be sometimes cooking and grab the knife, I'd stare at it for five minutes. You're standing there holding that knife. What was going through your mind? Well, all I could see on the knife was my reflection and all that was going through my mind is how pathetic I was. Finally, Tasneem's father helped her leave the country and last August, she severed all ties with her husband. Documents obtained by Seven News reveal federal police investigated 70 cases of forced marriage between January 2017 and September 2018. They include six children aged 10 or younger, three of them just six years old. Just this six months um, for the financial year 2018-19, we've already received 45 referrals to the AFP. Many underage marriages are posted online with brides much younger than Tasneem. That's absolutely disgusting and disgraceful. A 10-year-old with like a 7-year-old. Did they run out of women? Tasneem plans to write a book about her experience to raise awareness in the hope of saving other girls. He said, I do. Before I did, and then I said, I do. And I wish I did not. The full interview with Tasneem is on our Facebook page. Brian Seymour, 7 News.